uniform velocity. As I have discussed for the uniform speed, here at what I will say, a body is set to uniform velocity if it cover equal distance in equal interval of time in a particular direction. Here direction is involved. So that is very very important. So I am writing the definition because it requires in your exam define uniform velocity, define uniform speed. So all of you have to learn it. A body is said to have uniform velocity if it covers equal distance in equal interval of time in a particular direction. Direction is involved here because velocity is vector quantity. Then same thing here. No matter how small these time intervals may be. If I say an object is traveling with uniform speed, sorry, uniform velocity, what do I understand? Let me write because it is very, very important. You will read this sentence at number of places. An object traveling with uniform velocity then what do you mean? Just think. Student, when you read such sentence, I am again telling in the physics when we read the numerical part, we just we have to read the question very seriously and we should give some thought process. Here it is given this object is moving with uniform velocity. I hope velocity has both magnitude as well as direction. It is If that is uniform, that is not changing, that is constant. It will what we can say, object is having uniform motion along a straight line. Uniform motion along a straight line. So that we are supposed to know. Next, we will discuss non-uniform velocity. Of course, when it is a velocity, we have to think both magnitude as well as direction. So only definition is sufficient here. A body is said to have non-uniform velocity or variable velocity if it has non-uniform speed. Very first thing. When we say direct uniform speed means we are talking for the direction. When it is non-uniform speed means direction is regularly changing. Or direction and magnitude. The speed means magnitude. Magnitude is constantly changing. Second, I say its direction of motion keep on changing. And third, I say both. Its speed and direction changes with time. Listen children, when I say object, again I am explaining you, has non-uniform speed. Speed means only magnitude. When it is non-uniform speed means sometimes speed is 20 km per hour, sometimes 30 km per hour, that is changing. So you have to say velocity also changing, variable velocity. Sometimes speed may be constant, but direction of motion is changing continuously. Like the very simple example, I say circular motion. When object is moving in the circular motion, we will discuss in detail also later on. Suppose this object is moving in the clockwise circular motion, then every point direction of motion is along the tangent, like this, like this, like this, like this. If I see this object is moving with constant speed 15 meter per second, but every point of the circle direction is changing, so you will see speed is constant, 
but velocity is not constant because velocity for both the things should be constant if it is uniform velocity magnitude as well as direction and third we can say both its speed means magnitude and direction changes with time lot of example a car moving on a crowded road that is the example of this